Manufacturers struggle to access foreign currency, CZI, the Confederation of Zimbabwe Industry, CZI, says manufacturers are struggling to obtain foreign currency from the willing buyer willing seller, WBWS, platform needed to import critical raw materials. CZI CEO, Sekai Kuvarika said that while there has been a bit of stability in the market, businesses are finding it difficult to get foreign currency. Said Kuvarika. This is a serious issue. The manufacturers are failing to access Forex for their businesses and we are still engaging the monetary authorities over the issue that we believe that we have a bit of stability in the market but we have some serious issues on failing to access Forex. The challenge is that companies are not accessing the Forex they require for the importation of raw materials. As you know the manufacturing sector in Zimbabwe is highly import dependent, over 70% in most of the cases, Kovarika added that the CZI, which is the country's biggest business lobby group, has engaged the Reserve Bank of Zimbabwe Governor, John Mushayavanhu over the matter. Said Kuvarika, we have met the governor to discuss the piling of ZIG due to limited access to foreign currency to bring raw materials, from our conversations, the RBZ seems to be taking the law of averages into play where he argued that manufacturers may have significant US dollars local sales therefore their forex requirement may not be very high. Rufaro Zengini, an economic analyst, said the WBWS platform needs to be liberalized. Said Zengini, we have these contradictions where people are not allowed to bid higher if the RBZ has fixed the exchange rate, there would not be this shortage. There is a shortage of Forex and the prices have not moved in the past three months, something is wrong with those propositions as they don't reconcile, we still have a price discovery mechanism problem in the economy. Economist Prosper Chitambra said that the shortage of Forex on the official market fuels zig devaluation, 